Hey friends, welcome. Here's something quite unusual that I do from time to time. My brother's birthday's coming up and this is going to be a real unique gift for him that he's never seen anything like. What is it you may ask? Well, it's an 8x8 by 8 LED cube um, ornament MP3 player in an acrylic box basically. LEDs, a jig, nice acrylic case, uh, the main board, all of the SMD stuff and everything's already soldered except you have to build up a, a 512 LED cube pretty much. It's 8x8 on here for LEDs. This whole bag is LEDs. Just a few. I think there's 512 required for the 8x8x8. Um, there's probably a fair few spares in here. Basically you have to jig up 64 and solder them in a grid. And then repeat that 8 times. And then solder those onto this. Stick it in your case, the acrylic case that's here. And it gives you... An audio output, I think this is a 3 watt speaker, an mp3 player off a micro SD card. You run it off a USB to barrel jack, so any phone charger will be fine. Remote control, you can run a 3.5mm jack through it. It's got plenty of different programs on it. You can program it with a built in or included FTDI adapter. As I say, it's from my brother. He's never ever seen anything like it unless it's on a sci-fi movie of some sort. So I thought it'd be a really unique thing to do for him. Uh, got a month or two before his birthday, but get it done. Gonna enjoy doing it. I hope you follow along and see how I get on with it. Done all the menial little V's, 72 of these fiddly little things. Quite awkward to do. But nonetheless, running it. Should have seven LEDs on a test here. Yep, eight. And I have gone through rigorously testing all the others so the whole matrix of 8x8 is working the only other thing the jig where you put the LEDs in quite a bit of space behind so I've just put some little wood blocks underneath so I can sit in nice and tight posts are soldered into a board and all eight 8x8 grids are done ready to be mounted and tied in together I've checked them as I've done each one all working it's taken a fair few hours but it'll be worth it in the long run and the recipient will be happy all soldered up yeah works try to manage 500 leds obviously um heat and contortion and stuff but this test pattern press k1 and it initializes into auto mode once it's running k1 day and night just dims it, there you go, dim and back to brightness. K4 is audio mode, which takes a 3.5mm jack, and you can control, you can play MP3 on these buttons here from a USB stick or a SD card, play forward, back, um, and whatnot. 3D8, I think, is on K2, which is where you manipulate it via USB cable. But yeah, it's a really nice piece. Just going to put this in the um, acrylic case and I'll get some footage of it doing its thing. But the audio mode uh, does act like a graphic equaliser, which is quite cool. don't know how well the camera is capturing this, but it is truly mesmerising. Um, very bright as well.
Hey, Hey.